Hi, it's Ms. Moore from the Metuchen Public Library, and I'm here with Take 5. This week, we will be reading from This Moment is Your Life, and So is This One, a fun and easy guide to mindfulness, meditation, and yoga by Miriam Gates. You can find it in our card catalog by typing in This Moment is Your Life, and you'll see it's highlighted here in green, which means Metuchen owns it. So here's the book. What you will find is 90% of the time, this moment, the one you are in right now is just fine and also very manageable. There may be things in the past or future that you are concerned about, but right here, right now is okay. Being completely present, even for a little while can go a long way. It can help you feel more comfortable, confident, and even happy dealing with everything you experience on a regular basis. Try it. Unplugging from your thoughts and plugging into the present. Sit up tall and let your body relax. Take a deep breath in, then let a long breath out. Notice the calm here in the present. This moment is just fine. None of this is new information. All of the tools and techniques in this book have been used for thousands of years. People realized a long time ago that our constant rush of thoughts often makes us distracted and unhappy. We imagine worrisome outcomes for the future and we rehash unfortunate things that have already occurred. As a result, the life that is happening in this moment gets ignored. People discovered that the more we pay attention to what is happening right now, the more rational and relaxed we become. Today, mindfulness practices are used by successful people in every field. CEOs of Fortune 500 companies, Silicon Valley innovators, teachers, professional athletes, and Oscar-winning actors and producers. There is plenty of information available about how these techniques can support you, but don't take this book's word for it. Experience it yourself. In each chapter, you will find simple techniques for using mindfulness, awareness of your internal and external environment, to let go of stress and be present. It is up to you to find out if they are helpful. It is up to you to see if they make things easier. This book is about creating new habits. Everything you'll find here is called a practice, a mindfulness practice, a yoga practice, etc. Because each one is something you'll need to practice before it will work well for you. Each of these techniques will, will help you build your internal resiliency. Each one will help you get better at coping with stress and making good choices, no matter which way the wind is blowing through your life. You want to take the tree that bends able to feel rooted and strong, but relaxed and flexible in the midst of whatever is happening around you. The key to happiness is being able to be comfortable in this moment here and now. I hope you like that snippet of this book and that you feel free to place a hold on it and check it out from your library. See you next week. Bye-bye.